Good morning, ladies and gents. This is Andrew with Creative Crush, and we're doing another Fruit Files. Today, we're testing a little something right here. Oranges. And grapefruit. And a grapefruit. We're going to do two different tests. Hey we're doing a little baseball down here. So these are my friends. This is, uh, this is Ian Francis. And this is Colby. Now, Colby, I actually don't know your last name. Miller. Colby Miller. I should have known that. I guess that shows how good of a friend I am. Anyway, we're going to be testing a little something here to see in a pinch, could you replace a baseball or a softball with an orange and or a grapefruit? What do you think? Orange and grapefruit, will they break or will they stay intact? I'm thinking, I'm thinking they're going to survive. I'm thinking that we're going to get, like conceivably that you could have several pitches out of a single piece of fruit. What do you think, Kobe? I don't think so. You don't think so? No, I think it's done with one. Just done in one. Going off by how they feel, they feel pretty soft already. Yeah, they, they feel like a softball. You know. I'm gonna say they're gonna explode on first contact. We will see here. So uh, we've got to get our protective equipment on here. Very, we've got ourselves a uh, very a coat. Should should Kobe be wearing that? He's gonna be hitting. Yeah. Like, hit, get on me. Or hit. Yeah, like well, we don't know what's gonna happen. There is a potential for uh, a little bit of a mess on this, this one. We need, this We're gonna want to take it easy. You know. This has been a long time in the making. We've been thinking about this all week. All right, all right so first, orange first. Orange, orange first. Orange. We'll do grapefruit second. Grapefruit will come second. So the last one was banana ring, so I think we should call this uh, base orange. Base orange? Base orange. First pitch for base orange. Base orange. Take one. We've got a little of it right here. Yeah, There's a little more. There's a little bit in my in my beard hair on the upper lip. It's a good orange. All right. it smells, it smells good so too. Good. Oh, yeah, man. that smells great. Mm. Oranges that have been hit with baseballs smell better than normal oranges. Take True. a bite out of it. It's definitely like a branch. Pass them any. Yeah. <laughs> no. Yeah. That was, All right. That was definitely a foul. All right. Yeah. So let's try that again. Give it a more solid middle hit. Maybe that'll help. <laughs> Go for it. have a look-see here there's more of it over there there's a little bit of it so that was the orange now oranges have a little less you know plasticity on the inside you know they peel apart pretty simply but have you ever tried to peel a grapefruit you know when you try and take a grapefruit apart it's not as easy you know grapefruits have a lot of sinews and whatnot inside so I'm thinking the grapefruit will actually uh, it's gonna do it so we got the grapefruit coming up now <laughs> I got a little in my mouth. That was pretty yeah. tasty. But that was even faster than the orange. I was expecting grapefruit to hold up a little better. A little more uh, juicy. Let's get a good look I, at that. I, oh, wow. I got it all over my face. Look at that. Look at that little chunk right there. Mm, man, that smells good. Yeah, that smells great. You got some pulp on you, actually. <laughs> Here. So, uh, one thing is certain. Uh, Fruit that has been batted, actually, it releases the flavor and smell. Mm -hmm. It smells better. Yeah. So. Yeah, the the aroma is just. Mm. So, what did we learn from this? In your summer activities, when you're cutting fruit, you should be batting it instead. Yeah. So that it tastes better, it smells better. Overall, just gives you better experience in your picnics and your barbecues. When it comes down to cutting fruit, bat it. Let's get some more fruit files in next time. We'll get creative with you guys again later.